Hello, says gang. I hope you all are doing wonderful today. My name is Nati. So I will be happy to write to y'all energy. I want you all to take what feeds, sleep what does not. If anything does resonate with you, hit that like button, comment, subscribe to the channel. Squat rose is needed. Also, says gang, thank you, thank you, thank you for all the love, likes, comments. Thank you for the support. Thank you for everything that y'all been doing. I really appreciate and love each and every one of you all. All right, so I'm gonna do one more show for we're gonna hop right into y'all energy. All right, spirit energy for Sagittarius, please. Okay, so there's a rival here dominating the situation right now. Okay, this rival has a strong influence on your person here. Your person is choosing a rival. Um, now. I feel like this person is going to end up going through a deep transformation here, okay? They're not going to be able to resist the change. Um, but I feel like they're being manipulated by this rival energy for Sag. I feel like they could be doing, they could be to their breaking point right now, okay? In the connection and they're starting to see some sort of truth with the rival. Maybe they allow the rival to dominate the situation. Maybe it was too much drama going on or they were living a double life. Um, this rival could have been depending on them uh, for financial help. Maybe they could have been the only one working here. Um, this person is just exhausted. They're overworked here. Um, I do feel like this person lets the rival kind of seduce them like the rival is something here with this rival they're easily seduced okay so they're in this marriage with you this could be a married man or a married woman or someone in a long-term connection okay or they could even be married just take it how it fits it could even be something up with you here where they are sexually hooked or it could be difficult for them to choose. They are caught between two loves. They are loving both for different reasons. But they are spying on you knowing that you are walking away here while they are up to no good. They are having sneaky business here. Okay. Um, they have some sort of sneaky business. This person has disappearing acts. So you might not hear from this person for days all of a sudden. Or they keep their phone on silent. They always talk about they got to run errands. This could be someone who could have been in jail or prison here. I feel like there's been no further access in this connection here. Um, someone could be getting caught up here. This is someone that you could have met online here or this person has online dating. So y'all could either be married to this person. Um, there could be a third party. Um someone toxic here the rival okay um lack of healthy boundaries maybe this person had an online dating site here maybe they were doing some sort of suspicious online activity but they want to tell you that they are sorry here for the sneaky business okay or choosing the the rival over you because you are really their heart here um, you're their comfort zone here. Their heart belongs to you. I feel like they're being longer for you. Like I told you, y'all, this person is sexually hooked on y'all, okay, and emotionally. I feel like over here with the karma, it could have just been something sexual. They could have known this karma for a long time, or they could have been married, or this is someone they met doing some online dating. You guys could have been married to this person or with this person for a very long time. But they definitely want to apologize for the, the um, sneaky business. They've been longing for you suffering and silent. They're really going to realize somehow that they made a mistake by letting this rival dominate the situation over you and their connection because their heart is really with you. I feel like you're to the point where you are fed up right now. You are walking away. Um, you're tired of them ghosting you um, or screening you alone, using you as a plan B or being emotionally immature here. I feel like you are going to start focusing on yourself. For some of you, all you guys could have felt like this person was in it for money or for primary, personal primary benefits, okay? So some of y'all are going to start using protection, going to be protecting yourself, 
Uh, you feel like this person could have wanted to use you or wanted to use you for sex. You are just getting tired of the ghosting here. Energy for the collective. Yeah, some of y'all are finna start going on a date here. Ooh, some of y'all finna have a sneaky link. Or some of y'all are just finna start doing some dating, okay? Where um, you're gonna feel like the grass is greener. You're not gonna, per se, jump into anything. But I do feel like you're gonna be, like, on the dating scene. Just trying to heal, heal your finances. Yeah, you're going to end up surrendering. You're going to have romantic feelings for someone else. Some of y'all could be getting a divorce because, as I stated, some of you all could have been married to this person. This person really broke your heart here. Okay, but I feel like you're healing. You're following your intuition. You're listening to the cards. I do feel like, what's this fear card? I don't know. It could. What is this energy? Third party. Some of y'all could feel that y'all friend is a third party. Okay. You're the high priestess. You're very intuitive. You are heartbroken. Some of y'all could feel that y'all friend is a third party. Y'all feel that y'all man have been sleeping with your friend here. Okay, this has been an extremely toxic relationship. Maybe they could have gotten their mother involved in this connection for some of y'all. Okay, um, maybe you and their mother was friends and um, they could have been toxic and now it's a tower here. It's a tower coming here with, with this person. Um, they could fear that you are moving forward or dating someone new or dating someone else. Some of y'all are hiding from this person or have some sort of anxiety about this person. This ex lover. What's up with this ex? Um, they regret something here. Okay, they definitely regret. Some of y'all could have been arguing about this third party or what y'all found out about this third party. They could have been drinking or under the influence. They could have gotten physical here. Okay. Um, but this this um person over here regrets choosing the rival here. Um, they want to sacrifice the rival. This could have been a friend or someone who they claim to be a friend here. Energy for sides, yeah. That's going to start avoiding communication with the rival here. Energy for Saturn, please. Yeah, so this was just a temporary success over here. That there's something they were trying to hide, okay? Um, this this Empress in Reverse is the rival. This is the false Empress. This is someone who... This is a high vibrational here, okay? They're going to, some of these people are going to have to accept the fact that they chose this person over you because you could be literally moving forward here. Okay, so this is the third party here. Yeah, so some of y'all are moving forward. Some of these people might end up just being alone here. Maybe they could have had a child with this um third party here. Let me just for Sagittarius. Thank you, Spirit. Maybe they were indecisive. They didn't know who they wanted to be with. They ended up blocking you and caused you a tower. Caused you some sort of heartache. Some sort of anxiety after being toxic here. They just blocked you out or didn't choose you here. But they will approach you soon here. But they're going to be stressing about something. This could be somebody in their family that they chose. They're definitely going to be traveling towards you after some time of rejecting you. Okay, they're going to be approaching you. You know this because you listen to the cards or you're extremely intuitive. But I feel like you might have a guard up here because they've already hurt you. Like I said, this is someone you can have a family with. You're ending a cycle here. Things just didn't work out and you're choosing to heal. You're choosing to heal your finances. It was just a false start here. Um, This can be a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Gemini, Aquarius, Leo, Cancer. 
Sag, Leo, Aries, Pisces, okay? Um, yeah, so you're finna focus on what the universe has in store for you. Um, you're finna meet somebody new here. But if anything resonates, hit that like button, comment, subscribe to the channel, swap roles if needed. And until next time, Sag, game, bye.